When looking at how waves propagate, it's important to remember that the waves are going to propagate out from the source in a spherical pattern. In this video, you'll see the waves traveling in a cone shape, but in reality, they're traveling in all directions. Since they're moving out in a, spher a spherical pattern, as they get further from the source, their intensity diminishes. The formulas that you're responsible for for wave propagation are limited. In fact, these formulas you don't really need to know, just the ideas, and that is the intensity of the wave is equal to the power of the wave divided by how big the sphere is that it's propagated out into. And if the source of the sound is in motion, it's important to remember that the waves are going to clump up on one side, making a higher frequency, and spread out on the other side, making a lower frequency. This is known as the Doppler effect. Again, you're not really responsible for the equations, just for understanding the concept that frequency goes up on the one side and frequency goes down on the receding side. 